I believed in Now take a look at my achievements Thank the Lord I done went from nothing to something You just bought something, no The cost of opportunities is always good to know But if you know that, then you're good to go Yeah No dreams too big Chase anything, got the passion to do Only a dream till it happens to you Finally seeing money, now I'm acting a fool What's up everybody, Kevin Van Voris here for another video for you today I wasn't lying I'm, I'm trying to do these videos every day so even though I got a lot of stuff going on I'm still trying to do some videos but uh, I don't know if any of you guys know who KJ is I just found out about him he's from Texas I believe it sounds like he's from Texas pretty sure he's from Texas he's a dope white rapper he actually got some good lines um, anyways that's who that is I don't know if any of you guys even know who he is I think he's just an underground white rapper so I really like his lyrics and his beats and stuff so sounds really good anyways so let's talk about the thumbnail picture real quick no that's not my Jeep but I did want to I did want to comment on this real quick um, and then we're gonna go see the Trackhawk since some of you guys think I don't own it which I wouldn't believe that either if I haven't seen it for weeks anyways so it was just a matter of time honestly I mean the Trackhawks just got released and this guy looked like he picked his up and drove straight into a fucking wall obviously and that's gonna be the problem with any of these cars um, there's actually a video somewhere on YouTube I think and it's a guy who got his demon some older gentleman I think it was a black one and he's trying trying to do a burnout in the parking lot uh, when he's leaving and he like does a like half turn and oh I mean I'm talking almost hits a car so you can't get another demon like they're not gonna make you another one you can get another track hawk but you ain't gonna get another demon so I guarantee this person probably was driving bad weather probably floored it it's still 700 horsepower 650 to the wheels or 600 to the wheels or whatever it is uh, or 6 610 to the wheels It's a lot of power. I mean that is a lot of power and that's a 5400 pound vehicle. So guaranteed probably thought it was being cool Wrecked his shit and there's the first track hawk down. Honestly, I it's a matter of time I guarantee there's gonna be a few demons the same thing, you know 800 horsepower is nothing to be messed with especially when you got guys who drive Mustangs and that's why everybody gives Mustangs a lot of shit, but it's just you know You can get a Mustang for cheap a couple hundred horsepower rear-wheel drive not understanding how rear-wheel drive works And yeah hit a crowd or hit a pole or whatever so shout out to Austin for not hitting anybody with your Terminator So just wanted to cover that real quick uh I mean, <laughs> I saw the picture, and actually a few people tagged me, and I was like, is this your Jeep? And I was like, luckily, no, my, my Jeep is in my garage, just sitting there, waiting. Now it's at the shop at the new house. So I'm going to go over there, show it to you guys, just kind of give you a little overview. I've got a bunch of videos planned. Again, I'm in the process of moving. we got to be out of my rental in six days and our movers are coming tomorrow to move some of the stuff and then we've got to move most of it I just wanted to pay somebody to do all the big stuff like the fridge and uh, all the drawers and all that good stuff uh, what else the couch just the shit that I don't really want to move you know what I mean so that's the stuff that I'm gonna be paying somebody to move and then hopefully we'll be at the house Sunday good to go and I know this weekend's gonna suck as far as moving in and stuff. It's just, I, I hate moving. I don't know how you guys feel about it, but I absolutely hate it. I wish I could just throw everything away and just start over, but that's not how it works. So I've thrown a lot of shit away, but still trying to throw away more, I guess. And then you just gotta move all your shit to a different house. So we're gonna go over there. Uh, we'll probably get some lunch before. I'll show you guys what I eat if I remember to turn the camera on. So we gotta go get Rachel, go get Dave, and Let's go check out the shop. All 
All right, so I'm not gonna show you the entire garage. You'll probably see it behind me, but because um, I want to do a separate video. So, so those of you guys who don't think I own a Trackhawk, here it is. There she is. Look at how beautiful you are. There it is in all its glory. So. I have done a few modifications. We're going to make that a separate video, but I just want to walk around it, show you guys. It's been expelled. It's been coated. Um, Travis from uh, Texas Show Shine is actually going to, I don't know if he's going to come over to my house or I'll go to his house or wherever, but he's going to come wash it for me. Um, he actually just, I think he's, I think Travis is going to be living here full time now, which is kind of cool. So Travis travels around and details from like Arizona to Texas. I mean, he goes everywhere. Went to Colorado. He's like a traveling detailer. So it does a really good job. Um, I'm going to have him wash this because it's been sitting for a couple days. It's dusty and I want to like make a video for you guys of how to wash a coated car because this is my first coated car. Um, the Expel came out really good. You can't even tell. I mean, look at that though. Look at that paint. I mean, shit. Looks really good. So, uh, put the CA banner on. So we're up here. And again, this is a little dirty up here, so don't worry about all that. But that's up. Uh, windows are fully coated. Car is completely coated. Wheels are coated. Inside of the wheels are coated. The whole interior is coated. The engine's coated. Every piece on this vehicle is coated. Um, and I'll just take you around to the stuff that you guys probably already know. <laughs> uh, Misa, Lustrous Auto Styling, ended up wrapping the top grill for me. For those of you guys who have any Grand Cherokees, these little rings right here, they pop out. You don't have to take out the whole grill. Just take like a screwdriver or something. You can pop them out, they'll come out. You can wrap them, paint them, whatever. They actually make a kit um, that are that's on the is it the arctic version something like that that they come black and i i didn't know if these fit so i just wrapped them didn't want to take a risk now the bottom ones i didn't wrap which you guys can see right here i didn't wrap that um you actually have to pop it that way i think so pop it out the other way um did the headlights as you guys can see it probably looks a lot darker than it actually is but just a nice little tint to it so this is wrapped Tinted, tinted, CA decal, tinted, coming around, coming around. And then this is all ceramic, what is it? Ceramic window tint. This is my first time having ceramic window tint. 5% uh, all the way around. The windshield is tinted. I don't know the actual percentage. I think it's maybe like 70%, but it has ceramic in it. So it's see-through, which is nice, but um, so it gives it a little tint. Skylar did a great job on that. Skylar does really good tint. And then um, did the back. So got all these. Uh, where is it? That's done. And then I need to get a license. Oh, and then third brake light's done. What? What do you want? Sneaky. So that's all tinted. And then one thing I do want to change is the back badge. We get it like a black badge on it. So Dave's in here. What are you doing? Boom! <laughs> so, just wanted to give you guys an update. You're a bitch. <laughs> I want to give you guys an update. <laughs> Fuck Dave. Um, but yes, so there you go. Boom. It's all blacked out. Some people might like the blacked out look, some people don't. I've already had a white Grand Cherokee, which was, we wrapped in white carbon fiber. I'll drop a picture now if I can remember. Um, so that one was really good. So we'll get this washed. That'll be the next time you guys see this. And then we got a whole bunch of videos planned. We've got things I like, things I dislike. Should you get it? Should you wait for it to be used? All that good stuff. Uh, should you kick? Beat this shit. Should you kick David out of your house? Type of thing. So, um, but the paint looks good. You guys can. See, I mean, look at that. I mean, it's it is shiny. Shit. So, and I really like the yellow calipers on this. Uh, <laughs> if you guys want to see, there's Plumber Dave right there. 
Is my ass showing? Yep. <laughs> so make sure you guys comment, like, subscribe. Hopefully you like today's video. So hopefully you suck my dude. I'm trying to demonetize your shit. It won't get demonetized, okay? I only make like five dollars off YouTube anyways. Did you tell everyone how our family got real small this month? No, we'll go over that later. Well uh, we also have some uh, news about Misa and Austin. So you, Austin. we'll make another video about that yeah, down the road, bitch. but you guys will see probably on it's the videos. <laughs> on the videos, it's just me guys, and Dave. Guys, so guys. if I didn't gap Kevin already four times, <laughs> I've got something for your ass. <laughs> Dave's car's about to get wild. <laughs> He's gonna get walked. That's gonna be a thousand horsepower to the wheels. Okay. When? One thousand. March first. By March 1st, 1,000 horsepower right, guys, to the wheels. You heard it, March 1st, race going down for 500 bucks. You don't have $500! <laughs> I'll buy you canes when you lose, just to be sad. So, what are you putting your bets on? Remember my car's Yeah, tighter. make sure you bet, so. And go to my channel, and you'll see what it's going, what's going down next week. Oh, is it? Okay, so make sure you guys check out Dave's channel. But yeah, this one's gonna have 1,000, well hopefully, really, really, really close, probably like 960 or 980. Wow. So, I uh, got some fun goodies coming for that, and Dave got some goodies for that. So, anyways, that's it for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. No, I'm doing that's a separate video. This is just a track you hawk see. video. That's you can't see the rest hawk. of the garage in the shop. Hey, so, honestly, Ford Expedition over track oh hawk. my god. <laughs> anyways, thank you guys for watching today's video. Yes, I do own the track hawk. My name is Kevin Van Voris, and I'm out of this bitch. <laughs>